This video is brought to you by Card Empire. If you're looking for Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, or Magic of the Gathering, this is the place to be. Oh, what's up, people? Dobbs Woods right here, and welcome to another Pokemon pack opening. There's only two pack openings left, so go ahead and check out Card Empire, the place to be in Manchester, Stockport, and Liverpool. And today we are opening up my boy Lucario, the one I'm running out for favourite to win this tin battle. Now, as you guys know. If you guys are new to the channel, like always, I always have to explain it to you. What are the rules to the Pokemon Tin Battle, or any Pokemon Battle? The promos and the normal holo rares are worth one point. It doesn't matter on what type of promo it is, whether it's a full art, a rainbow, anything like that, it's worth a point because you're guaranteed to get it. And also, normal V cards, are worth two points. A full art is worth three points. A rainbow rare is worth four points, including the amazing rares. Okay? Amazing rares are worth a lot because they actually are worth a lot. And then you also have the big booster one, which is worth five points or six points, whatever you want to pick. The most expensive card in the set, which of course here in Fear of Voltage, is the Fat Pikachu. That's what we want. There's also some good cards in Sword and Shield and also uh, breaking point. So let's go ahead and once again, I still don't like this. They need to really plan this out a lot better for us in Pokemon. That just shot out super easily. And it looks like it's okay. There's your promo card. There's the price. Sweet. And there's your code. And it's gone. So, last pack opening, as you guys know, we pulled the Charles out for some weird reason, but it was a reverse foil rare, so it's not worth any points. But it's still going into my collection. But Slowbro Pulp only got two points, so Luko just needs to get himself a V card and he pretty much wins the whole thing. So that's quite awesome. First off, break point. Now just to let you guys know as well, there is break cards in this as well. So if you get a break card. They're worth absolutely nothing, but still, I'm going to class them as a one-pointer, like a holographic, because they are not very valuable, just to let you guys know. Three cards on the back, we got ourselves a Splash Energy, Electrovire, we've got Reverse Valley, we've got Shelda, Drowsy, Slowpoke, Clefairy, Psyduck, a Reverse Foil Rare, Garbodor, which is nice, one of the best cards, to be honest, for tournaments, and a Zeb Striker. To be honest, I actually not. I am not. I am pretty much happy that I got a reverse foil Garbodor. To be honest, that's actually quite a bit of a pricey card back in the day. Next pack, Sword and Shield. What can we get out of this? Probably a gold card, which is awesome. And we start off with my favourite Pokemon, Score Bunny from the new gen, which of course, as you guys know, is going to be my next tattoo in the near future. I got Unlisted Leaf Energy, Quailfish, Energy Switch, Dotler. We've got Score Bunny, Nickit, Chinchow, Diglett, Forest Seed, a Energy Switch. Oh, there we go. We get Victini V. Okay, yes. Okay, V for victory. Luke Coyo is winning with the victory. We got two points right there. Let's go. Victini V. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Sweet. TV cards. Awesome. So that's three points all together because you guys know Luke Coyo was the promo. Next pack. So right from the start now, we got three points, which is awesome for the trusty Lucario. Here's your cards. And we got one, two, three, four. Let's have a looky. We got Lightning Energy. Giraffe Rig. Spell it backwards. It's called Giraffe Rig. <laughs> we got Electrite. We got Anchors Away. We got Baby Mode Hall. Oh, crappy days. We got a Shuppet. We got Fur Seed. We got Joltic. We got Sandile, we got a verse wall, Ferris Seed, and a Crocodile, which is, this one looks extremely thick. Thick. Fair enough. Final pack of Vivid Voltage and the final pack of the tin. What can we pull? Hopefully something awesome. Something amazing, let's hope. There's your code, and it's gone. One, two, three, four. Let's have a looky. We got ourselves a Fighting Energy. We got Telescope Sight, we got Mariana, we got Toombeak, we got Ferris Seed, we got Dedini, Drilba, Oshiwat, Duskull, and a, a Clobbing Octopus, 
and a Clefable. Never mind. Either way, Lucario is winning, ladies and gentlemen, by one point, to be honest. It's got three points now, which is awesome. So before we say goodbye, people, let's have a look at what we pulled today. For a verse for a rest, we got a verse foils, we got ourselves Clubbing Octopus, Feather Seed, and Entity Search. For a verse for a rare, to be honest, which is awesome, which is a Garbodor with first for a rare, which is awesome. And then for a hollow rares of the day, we got ourselves our promo Lucario and our victory win, Victini V. Awesome. <laughs> If you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't, and go ahead and check out Card Empire, the place to be in Manchester, Stockport, and Liverpool. With that being said, the people of Snoogle, see you guys for subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Lucario, you're winning. Keep on winning, my friend. Let's win this. I like getting these. These are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!